This video was made possible by the EA Creator Network. They're exchanging their vows. It seems a little awkward and I don't know why. Is it because they both have lice? <laughs>
little couch. This is giving me more of like an Indian wedding vibe, which I really like. I love this like very simple beach chair, giving you some honeymoon energy. And I also love that all the swatches are pretty much all the same color. So you can really like be cohesive with everything. Classic wooden table with a runner, cute. I like that there's rainbow swatches of everything that makes me happy. And this I'm sure will match the Casper chair. It does. This like even gives me graduation energy, which I feel like we could actually have like graduation parties and things like that now because of like how the game is played. We got, oh, this beautiful kind of like bar shelving, I guess. We got some dance floors. I'm not obsessed with some of these like designs, but I love this piano. I think it's really pretty. I could totally see our boy Archer throwing down on the black version of this piano. This is like a toast bucket. So if you approach the toasting bucket, you can like give a little speech at like events and stuff. This would be perfect also for like a graduation or whatever. And then this is a gravy fountain. Oh my gosh. I wonder if it just does gravy. I guess we'll find out. And then there's like this wooden banquet kind of table, which is is, I think, gorgeous. I love the black. They've got a new bar. Not that in love with the bar. And then we've got two different types of tea sets that the characters can all use. And then we have tons of different wedding arches. These arches are all just really pretty. This is kind of more of like a in the woods kind of nature energy. This one I also think is more woods, but maybe more garden. This one's super modern. They really cover it all. And then we've got the flower shop. We've got some bouquets. I love these curtains. I feel like I'm gonna be using these curtains a lot. And then you have these wedding aisles. So this one's like a hidden one. It doesn't show up if you just didn't want like a plain wedding aisle, but also has wedding aisles with flowers on each side and they come in different lengths. I like a couple of those. We can't really see it here, but I really like this kind of just gorgeous flowered canopy kind of thing. It's so pretty. Great, okay, so those are all the build items. I feel like it's a terrible day to start like our wedded bliss, to be honest. But over here is where the town square is. Open at 9 a.m., closes at 6 p.m. Isn't it 10.45? Oh, it's Sunday. Oh my gosh. Oh, I like that they have a good amount of friendship and romance from becoming fiancés and creatism. Grapevine gossip, I think that's new. Plan wedding event, yo, and make joke about marriage. Okay, express doubts about marriage. Enthuse about upcoming wedding. We're gonna do that one. I think that they're into it. Let's plan the wedding event. We need to also make friends so that we can invite people to our wedding because I wanna see whether or not they'll sit down. Okay, oh, vow renewal. There's a wedding ceremony, a rehearsal dinner, a reception, a family gathering. We should definitely do a batch party. Like maybe tonight might be a good batch party moment. And then the host is obviously Lavender. Archer can be a guest. Mixologist, they're gonna hire one. And an entertainer, they're gonna hire one. Oh, desired activities. Well, they gotta dance. I love that you can pick these activities. You could do drinks, desserts. We're gonna do all of them. And the location is gonna be Celebrazioni del Amor. Oh, I love it. Very Italian. We love to see it. Hopefully some people will show up like that aren't a part of our party and that way we'll just invite them to the wedding. But we're having our batch party. It's a duo. Okay, ooh, here's a person. It's Mila, Mila. Oh, kick out of wedding event is a thing? You can just kick the wedding guests out? Oh, that's kind of nice. Nessa's our entertainer. Here's the drink bucket. We're just gonna introduce ourselves to everybody. Wait, can we have her join our wedding? Ask about wedding day. Ask to be officiate. Ask to be sim of honor. Oh, this is so cute. Meanwhile, Lavender's, oh, where are you? Okay, she went rogue. Oh my gosh, it's Agatha. We've got to go introduce yourself to Agatha. So she's going to enthuse about her wedding, announce her engagement, be like, I'm engaged. Lavender can't wait to tell everyone it's engaged. It's her favorite topic of conversation because she just can't keep it inside anymore now onto the wedding planning. Oh, that's cute. Can we ask her to be the sim of honor? What if she says no? Oh my God, Agatha said yes. Oh, she's gonna be our sim of honor at our wedding. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's get drinks. This is a very interesting batch party, I'm not gonna lie. It's not, you know, exactly what we'd have in mind, but okay, we're gonna just keep introducing ourselves to all of these sims so they can come to our wedding. They haven't done the drinks still, so that's kind of awkward. I like asked them to do the drinks a couple different times. 
and they haven't done it yet. Okay, but Lavender's made a lot of friends, which we love for Lavender. He's having a bad time at his batch party. This makes me sad. Is it because of the music? I feel like we should be able to change the music, but why don't you slow dance together with Lavender instead? Oh my gosh, I can't wait to see them slow dance. <gasps> oh my God. I love these characters so much and watching them slow dance with each other at their batch party is so cute. Okay, Lavender's gonna make a toast. He's the only member of the batch party and he's like not at the toast for some reason. Okay, that's not quite what I was hoping for in terms of the toast, but they did have their toast. They were just in different rooms for it, which we don't love, but. Oh, their batch party's over. It ended a little unceremoniously. The batch party was fun. I feel like it would be interesting to see it with more Sims. Still a little chaotic, but a little better than usual, I suppose. So we're gonna plan their wedding outfits for their wedding day. All right, so with the game pack, what is new? So it looks like for formal shirts, we have this one. And then we also have like a suit. Oh, it comes in like a nice little pattern. It also comes without. I love it. Full body outfits. We've got this one. Oh, I like that. It's kind of glittery. This looks like a mother of the bride type of dress. This one's pretty. It comes with like a hairstyle too. It changes the hairstyle. Oh, I love this tailored suit. I feel like I'm going to put all my women in this. This is giving me Joker vibes, but that's neither here nor there. Oh, I like this. Kind of like pants with a little over skirt. How like a lot of these also give me like good wedding guests. I love this one. I think I would really like this one in the white. Yeah, and I like the slit. That makes me happy. Okay, there are some new hairs. There's this one, very nice. And then there's this one. Oh, which I love. I feel like this suits lavender very well. I think there might be new makeup. Wow, I actually really like this eyeshadow a lot. And I normally don't like Sims eyeshadow. We forgot the boutonnieres. I think those are really cute. We're gonna keep the necklace though. And then we have new wedding nails, which I really like the wedding meal, so we're gonna keep those. I love Lavender's new little outfit. I think it looks great. Let's give Archer his new outfit too. Oh, I like this one a lot. I like this that there's just a shirt with an open tie. I don't think we've had one of these before and it's so attractive. It's so pretty. Well, he's not gonna wear it to get married, but there's this one without a sh shirt underneath, which I think definitely reminds you of something Archer would do. Oh, wow. So royal. This one too looks very royal. I guess that's the point of weddings to feel like royalty or one of the points, I guess, for, for some people. I think we'll go with this though, the kind of more traditional wedding. There you have it. They plan their wedding looks for the wedding. And we're gonna have of her buy her wedding bouquet. I kind of wanted like a pastel purple look, but I'm not seeing that. So I think the blush rose. Okay, she bought her bouquet. All right, why don't you both sit over here? I want to see a make out on this little town square area. Okay, sit together. What are they both holding? I want to see them like make out on here. There we go, make out. Oh, it's so romantic. Oh, wow, that is so cute. Okay, I love that. That makes me happy. But okay, I think that this seems like the perfect time to plan a wedding. Ooh, we could do a rehearsal dinner. I think I'm gonna save some of this for when I play for the Not So Very Challenge. The bride and groom, the Sim of Honor is Agatha. We can invite all of these people as our guests. Which, all right, and then at the weddings, we want a first dance. We want a walk down the aisle. We want an exchanging of vows. We want to cut the cake and we want to have a little spousal kiss. Those are their outfits. No wedding cake selected. Okay, I'll get a wedding cake when I get there, I guess. Dress code is polished and the color is purple. We are going to be having it at, it just feels like this wedding venue doesn't feel like their style. I feel like you can place other wedding venues though, but ah, we'll just go here. Here we are. Okay, is everyone gonna change? Why is everyone in these outfits? Okay, this wedding venue is very cute. I'm not going to lie, it is very cute. <gasps> Look at this, this is the aisle. Ah, okay, 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 okay. Okay, they're all like pretty chaotic right now. I don't like this. I don't like that they're not in their outfits. Outfits, 
change into your formal wear. Am I having to like tell everyone to do so? Oh, I guess they have like little purple boutonnieres. You know what? They are all wearing purple. I'm now like kind of seeing, well, they're not all wearing purple. And also I asked for them to be classy. This is supposedly like not the final version of the game, they did say. That wasn't even a problem before of the game, right? Like they all came in the right outfits before. I guess let's maybe have everybody take their seats. Please take your seats. Okay, let's see if the please take your seats works. Okay, what? These ones don't look like they're taking any seats. They're kind of doing it, but not. Okay, and lavender seating, whatever. That's fine. Okay, gather at the aisle. Maybe that's the thing. Gather at the aisle. Okay, and then please take your seats. Oh my gosh, this is a mess. Everyone go sit down. Oh, it's because there's multiple places for them to take their seats. Okay, this is chaotic. Okay, I'm gonna make like a group and I'm going to have them all go here. Maybe that'll help. It kind of just feels like there's too many like locations. And so it's like confusing the Sims, but I think they're kind of doing it. So everybody, please take your seats over here where I've clicked for the take the seats. Oh God, and now everyone's leaving. He's walking down the aisle. Do, 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 do. He's crying. He's so happy. Okay. And then walk down the aisle. Your turn, Lavender. Oh my gosh. Why are they kissing? She literally cannot walk down the aisle because these Sims are in the way. I'm going to kick them out of my wedding. Please get out of the wedding. Okay. Please leave or sit down. Look at her. She's walking down the aisle. Oh my gosh. This is taking a while. Okay. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's a little more organized, but it is still quite chaotic. Okay. It's happening. They're exchanging their vows. It seems a little awkward and I don't know why. Is it because they both have lice? He just put the purple ring on her finger. Oh, that's cute. He did it twice. Okay, not as cute. And now he's doing it again. I don't know why she's talking to this guy in the middle of her wedding. What is happening here? Stop talking to this man. Finish your vows. Oh my gosh, this feels like a mess. I'm not gonna lie. Please just get married and kiss. Their faces weren't even together. Oh my gosh. All right, can we do like a walk down the aisle together? There we go, it's the send up. All right, there <laughs> he put his arm through hers. Oh, that was cute. A little short, but all good, all good. Okay, now we need to buy a cake. I don't know where to buy a cake. Ooh, this is the thing. Fill the fountain with chocolate, fruit punch, sparkling apple juice or cheese. That's fun, okay. Gather for the bouquet toss? Okay. Oh my gosh, I'm actually really excited to see this. Oh my God, look, they're all like peeing themselves and they're dirty now. This is more chaotic just in a different way. They are not doing the bouquet toss at all. There's this woman on a bike. Sophia Bjergstein just showed up. It's a wedding venue. You'd think that like just random Sims can't show up. Let's see if we can buy a wedding cake really fast. Okay, purchase a wedding cake. All right, here's all the options. Okay, I think this is the one I kind of wanted. All right, we're gonna put it here. We'll do the cake cutting. Oh, that's adorable. Please everyone gather for the cake. They're really not doing it. Ooh, select a cake topper. That's cute. Let's do some blush roses on top. Very sweet. All right, and then cut cake with Archer. All right, we're gonna just go cut the cake. Nobody's coming over. Oh my gosh, Archer already took a piece? Archer, get up, cut cake with lavender. Are you kidding? I was like, at least this interaction should... What's going on? Why can't we do that? Can we just feed the cake to Lavender? Apparently we can. All right, so he's feeding the cake to Lavender. Apparently he cut it himself before she was there and I didn't get to see it. This is cute though. I liked the little delicate feeding that they did. And then we want to do the first dance. Okay, and they're meeting here. She's still eating her cake. Good for her, good for her. And there's not really music, but they're gonna dance supposedly. There they go. The dancing's working. They technically did go down the aisle. It's still just a little chaotic, but I do love a little bit of chaos in the Sims. So I'm not going to lie. That part is very fun. I just kind of wish when I asked the Sims to do stuff that they would. Oh, that's sweet. Okay. Well, we're going to end this wedding early because I I don't know. I really wanted to end this video going like, go out and buy it. It looks so fun. I think there's a lot of potential here, but it's just not functioning. Like almost none of it is. And that's like the whole point of the wedding. The new world is beautiful. I do love all the Kaz items. But at the end of the day, the reason I wanted this pack was for the wedding. And the wedding was just as chaotic, if not more so because it was frustrating because I had all the things that I supposedly could do, but 
but none of them happened, which was honestly just really disappointing. This isn't the final version of the game. I'm hoping that there's some bugs worked out, but these are like the core points of this pack. And this is the press review. I love The Sims. I truly believe the gurus are doing a great job and I sincerely hope that these issues are fixed soon. So overall, I unfortunately wouldn't recommend purchasing this game pack as is. Hopefully it is updated and that these bugs are fixed very soon. I am intrigued, but I am not sold. And that's where I'm gonna leave this one. Thank you guys for tuning in and <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.